Hello, incoming Harbor sophomores. Have you ever tripped going down the stairs in front of everyone? Because I have, and it was embarrassing, but hilarious at the same time. Now that I have your attention, I would like to thank, take the time to thank a couple of people that helped me get through my high school year. First off, I like to thank my church. They've really gotten close to me and became more like a family rather than just people you see every now and then. They really helped me get through those tough times when I just wanted to give it all up. They were there to lift me up. Secondly, I'd like to thank my friends as well for making my senior year a blast and for being there for me as well when I needed someone to talk to. Lastly, I'd like to thank my parents for all the support that they have given me as well, for the lessons that they've taught me through the years and for the overwhelming love that they've shown me. I am here today giving you three important tips that you should carry with you throughout your high school years. But the main message of this all will be that in your high school years, all you need to carry within you is being different from everyone else and your own person. Try your best to be that person that makes a difference and doesn't just follow what everyone else does. To start off, you need to be yourself. High school can be a scary place, especially if you're an incoming sophomore because you have no clue of what you're supposed to and not supposed to do. Most people are always terrified to go against what the majority of people are doing or laughing at. But Ralph Waldo Emerson once said, to be yourself in a world that is constantly trying to make you something else is the greatest accomplishment. And I believe that that is true because today's society teaches us that conformity is the easiest and most successful path to follow. In high school, all you wanna do is try and fit in. But not everyone usually fits in, so that's when the part of you being yourself comes in action. Through most of my high school years, I remember how I tried so hard to fit in, and I finally did, but it was with the wrong crowd. They wanted me to only hang out with them and no one else, and I didn't like that. So I decided to leave them and try to go look for some new friends. I never could exactly find my place to fit in here in high school, but I did have many friends outside of school. So my senior year, I decided to do my own thing, and so far, it's been going pretty great. I am currently down to two weeks left of high school, and I could honestly say that senior year was the best year out of my junior and sophomore year. My second life lesson for incoming sophomores would be to be wise with your time. Time is everything. No matter what the situation is, you need to learn how to manage your time wisely, or else you'll stress yourself out more. For example, deadlines are super important to keep in mind, especially in high school because time goes by way too fast for you to be wasting it on useless things. For instance, just this year I had a two-page essay report due for chemistry and the teacher gave us one week to do our research and everything for the experiment and then three days to write our essay report over the experiment. But of course, if you're like me, I was a big procrastinator during my high school years. I always waited till the last minute to do everything and that never helped me because I fell back on my grades and that stressed me out. Then I had a pile of work to do and of course all of that messed up my sleeping schedule as well. But from that day on I began to stay on top of my school work and I even made myself a planner and it has really helped me a lot throughout this school year and I will definitely be one thing that I will be doing more often to keep myself on track. Last but not least is to never give up. Always try your best in everything you do, even if it's something that you don't like at all. Give those three last years of high school your all because those three years are the ones that matter the most. Pull through every obstacle that comes at you during your high school experience because in the end, it all pays off. All the hard work, all those sleepless nights that you have to stay up till 3 in the morning studying for that big test, all of that work will pay off in the end and in the end you'll feel so relieved but accomplished as well. You'll be able to look back and say, I did that. In my personal experience, I struggle with this because I never really liked school. I wasn't a big fan of waking up early and then having to be in school for 8 hours. But now that I look back at all those years, I'm like, wow, did I really make it through all 13 years of my school career? 
seniors. We are currently down to two more weeks of school and ready to start a new chapter in our lives. Furthermore, dream big, never give up. The most important thing you can do for yourself. Never lose focus on what you aim for in life. The idea is to never build barriers in your heart. And do everything with love. People who fight against the wind always have a chance to gain because they prefer the risk and gain experience.